queste luci, tutte queste voci, tutti questi amici, tu dove sei? Tutto questo tempo pieno di frammenti e di qualche incontro e tu non ci sei. Tutte queste radio piene di canzoni che hanno dentro un nome, ecco chi sei. Non ti sai nascondere per me. Quante volte sei passata? Quante volte passerai e ogni volta è sempre un colpo all'anima, all'anima. Tutto questo posto forse è troppo visto, deve avere un guasto, tu non ci sei. Tutte quelle case piene di qualcuno e fra quei qualcuno tu con chi sei. Tutte queste onde pronte a scomparire, resta solo il mare, quanto ci sei, non ti sai nascondere davvero. Quante volte sai... Um, I came on the trip, I studied Italian for a year at Baylor, and I realized that it was going to be very hard to learn uh, the language in a fluent way by just studying for an hour every day. So I decided to embrace myself in the culture. Um, I decided to go to Florence because I was studying Italian already, so I figured why not uh, finish up those last two semesters abroad. And uh, I think the coolest thing about the trip so far has just been getting to live in the center of all the action. Florence is beautiful. It has been so fun to explore the city and meet lots of fun people that um, are native to Florence. Um, and also just to be submerged in the culture and get to know Italians and get to practice in Italian. There's no better way to do that unless you come to Italy. If, you, if you're thinking about coming to Italy at all, or if you're taking Italian especially, this program is a must. I especially like how friendly people are here, especially if you tell them you're studying Italian. Coco e fragola, which is coconut and strawberry, you combine them and it's amazing. My favorite flavor would probably be pistachio or Nutella. Nutella, which is hazelnut. And no contest, it is the best. Uh, my favorite gelato is vino e formaggio, which is uh, wine and cheese. My favorite gelato fa flavor has been uh, after eight, it's like mint chocolate chip. It's delicious. Favorite gelato was the wine and cheese gelato. Really, really good. What surprised me most about Italy is um, just how much you can get out of Italy and how much there is in Florence to see. How friendly the Italian people are, even though we totally botched their language. My favorite place that I've been in Italy so far. Really, I love all of it. Uh, my favorite place that I've been to would be San Gimignano, which is a town about um, two hours away from Florence. And um, I stayed at a farm and got to see the countryside. Really, these places are hard to compare. I mean, you've got like Siena, which is a fortress city from the Middle Ages, and you've got Pisa with the Leaning Tower of Pisa. And then you've got the Cinque Terre, which I think so far has been my favorite. Everywhere is really, really, really gorgeous. But I would have to say Siena, probably, just because the architecture is just amazing. I love how much art and how much culture and just how overwhelmed I am by everything here. It's been wonderful. There's the food, but then there's the... The, the cultural things and then there's the historical things and then there's the views. It is like one of, I would say one of the best city abroad programs ever because you knock out two credits. It's, it's like a decent price and you just get to experience so much. Why come to Italy? Why not?
Sei mai 